Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be flipping through my photo card binders. For the moment I have two but they will be split into different binders very very soon but in the meantime it'll be interesting to see where those are at and they are honestly very very full and do need to be split up but it will just be a nice little update of where my collections are at and actually my first binder video that I posted was in December, mid-December I think 2020 so it's been about six months of collecting a little bit more so it'll be a good point for an update I will start with my multi binder first and then go to my BTS binder so this binder has a lot of TXT and Pentagon and then a teeny little bit of Purple Kiss and Luna. So the front page is uh, this painting that I did of Subin in the AR concept for Blue Hour. I will probably chain it up soon with a world concept Yonjun but I will keep Subin somewhere in the binder for sure <laughs> and this is the first page with photo cards so we have Yeonjun star photo cards here as well as Hyuninkai's uh, theater photo card and the group photo card just because uh, when I purchased the star album uh, Hyuninkai's PC was with Yeonjun's PC and I love Hyuninkai a whole, whole, whole lot so he's got some things here and there in this binder and then I put the TU Magic Yeonjun photo card here as well just because of the size and I also put his light stick PC because well at the time I wasn't really collecting non-album photo cards for him so it fit the page nicely in terms of size as well and era but uh, it will be moving soon because I do plan on getting more non album photo cards for Yeonjun and some of them are 8 pocket sized so then we go to the second page and this is just the uh, magic and eternity eras I actually have this photo card on the way uh, so my main priority for Yeonjun right now is to buy his magic ID cards and then his Korean photo card collection will be complete and then I'll be moving on to non-album photo cards and I also really do want the With You Eternity pre-order benefit, it's really cute and I really love the back of it actually as well, it's black and it's just really cute. I just put this filler here, it's just a freebie and it's a group freebie and I thought it looked really really cute and then I just have uh, the little logos from the eras and the back is like amazing. I'm like, oh no. <laughs> Some TXT freebies are honestly uh, off the charts. So here we have the Blue Hour era. Uh, I am planning on getting uh, Yeonjun's Weave Us Round 2 pre-order benefit and it kind of looks like this one. Honestly, it just kind of flipped around. <laughs> and then I will be getting a replica of one of his lucky drawers. I am thinking of the crop top lucky drawer, I mean, because that one is very iconic, but we will see, we will advise when it comes around to this. But for now, I'm pretty satisfied with this page. And then I kept Bumbu's, Bumbu's PC because it's the first PC I ever pulled. And then we've got the Wiz Use uh, period of benefits here and just uh, Yeonjun's inclusions. Then in terms of the postcards, I have all of Yeonjun's postcards and then I've got Kai's because it was in the album that my friend Melanie sent me. And then I have Subin's as well because I pulled it. <laughs> and then I'm planning on getting Taeyeon's postcard for the VR version so then I can have an inclusion of every member for the Blue Hour era which is uh, when I was officially calling myself a MOA, even though during Eternity I definitely watch uh, the comeback show, but anyway. <laughs> then we move on to Freeze. Uh, this is the OT5 page for the Origin photo cards. And then we're going to have Yeonjun's album photo cards, as well as all of his pre-order benefits. <laughs> I'm going to also have the group order benefit from Target in here and then I pulled Kai's PC so I decided to keep it uh, especially because it's a little damaged at the back so I mean I don't feel like reselling it or trading it away because I'm like that's not really fair uh, but it looks fine in the binder. 
uh, then this is just more Yeonjun Pre-Order Benefits. I decided to not collect any Lucky Draws for him just because it's just too much. But yeah, I did get all of his Pre-Order Benefits and they're on the way. Then we move on to uh, his Japanese photo cards slash Shine Together uh, ticket card PC page. Uh, this will be moving to a different page, but for now it's just staying here because it looks cute in the middle. But yeah, I definitely need to work on his Japanese album photo cards, uh, but I don't know, that Magic Hour reply is just way too expensive so we will see what happens with that but i'm just very happy to have all of his still dreaming photo cards and i think they just look so cute and yeah then we have the shine together merch uh one is the bag one is the bandana i'm not sure which one was which and this is the t-shirt unit photo card I feel like I say this every video, but I'm like, oh no, anything with the Yonkai on it just calls to me and it's very unfair from Big Hit's part to do that to me. And then I decided to collect both of the special PCs for the units, uh, for the mini photo cards, and then I will have Yonkai's other mini photo cards here. Then we've got all of Yonjin's mini photo cards that I did not arrange in the number order because I thought it looked not so nice <laughs> but I rearranged it this way and then we move on to Pentagon so for Pentagon I just put Huey's romantic uh, lover take mini poster just as a divider and then we go on to the positive era because that's why I'm starting to have photo cards for them uh, even though I am still missing Yuto and Yanans but I am taking Pentagon collecting a little bit more slowly then BTS and TXT, uh, but yeah, I'm still collecting Yuto, Yanan, and Hui. Here I will have uh, Yuto's thumbs up photo cards, and as well as Hui, Yanan's, and I need to get Woosok's PC as well for uh, summer, but I think it'll look very cute, and I really do like the summer PCs, and I think they're very cute. Then we've got the Black Hole era. This is when I started uh, standing Pentagon. Uh, with my friend Leah, <laughs> she just got me into Pentagon during this era and uh, me when I was watching stages and I was like oh I really like the dude with the blue hair and the dude with the green hair and I was like no you're just saying that because they have different colored hairs and um, here we are! <laughs> Uh, my biases, but yeah, we have uh, who's upside, who's downside, and these are the pre-order benefits, I believe, uh, which they have different color bags, <laughs> and then we've got Yuto's upside, Yuto's downside, I am absolutely obsessed with this photo card, like, it's one of my favorite photo cards for Yuto, like, I'm obsessed with it, a whole lot. But yeah, these are his pre-order benefits, and these are the album photo cards. It does make me giggle that Pentagon is always just like, oh yeah, we're going to have one glossy photo card and then one concept photo card that is going to be matte. And I'm just like, okay, at least there's a theme. Then we go to the With era, which was when I started collecting Pentagon. <laughs> but yeah, I've got all of Huey's album photo cards as well as the scratcher and then I have his make star pre-order benefits and his k-town pre-order benefits and I'm just very happy to have a full nine pocket page for Hui because he is my old bias in pentagon and then for Yanan I only have his album photo cards and his scratcher and same for Yuto and then we move on to the with bookmarks which are <laughs> I so I have all of the bookmarks for uh Hui Yanan and Yuto and then I actually just had pulled Hong Sok and Woosok's bookmarks and I just thought that they would look nice in this four pocket setup so I decided to keep them and then I just have Hui's Yanan's Yuto's and Woosok's stickers for with uh, because Woosok is my fourth bias <laughs> so I do tend uh, to keep some of his stuff as well but this is the beginning of the Lovatech era so this is just a 
periodo benefit page so Hui has mixed around one and then there is Apple Music and DMC for Hui Yan and Anuto. Uh, the Apple Music ones I believe were the pink back ones and then the DMC around one for two cards are the ones with the white bags. But yeah, so then we have the romantic version page. So everyone is complete for now. And I also decided to put the K-Town Periodo benefits because they fit nicely with the romantic concept. And uh, I mean, Yuto went as far as uh, <laughs> being very, very similar. But then we have the sporty version. And I actually had this Hui PC got lost in the mail, but that's okay. And then I have the mild version where all of these got lost in the mail, but uh, I will be working on those. Maybe not this month because I'm going to try and spend less money in July, but <laughs> I will eventually finish it up. And then we will be moving on to Purple Kiss. So for Purple Kiss, I collect Chain, Dosi and Ire, and Chain is my main bias, so I got a Pearl de Benefit for her as well. Just to, you know, make it a little bit more special. But yeah, these are the album photographs and this one is the Mixta Run 2 Pearl de Benefit. Uh, I actually had it in the middle, but just moved it to the side because then when you turn the page, yeah, it's a bit more, you've got like the row of white back photo cards in a diagonal and I am very obsessed with uh, all the backs of their photo cards so I'm very in love with that and they are rumored to have a comeback pretty soon so I'm happy to have that completed and then I've got Ire sticker and a chain sticker just because I pulled Ire sticker and then I uh, just got chains to all have all of her inclusions and then this is just the ticket that came with the album which I really love and I hope that they keep doing them for all of them albums and then we will go to my very sad Luna page <laughs> but uh, I've got this uh, Jin Soul and Kim Lip unit photo card and Jin Soul's 2021 season's greetings photo cards and then I just have a woods freebie in the middle because the six PC pattern looked really sad so I decided to just add one and make it a seven pattern but yeah uh, I don't know maybe I will buy my favorite photo cards for this Luna comeback because paint the town is I'm just obsessed with it and so I'm like okay maybe I will pick my favorite photo cards for Jinsoul this era and collect those but no promises because as I said I'm trying to save money <laughs> but let me move on to my BTS binder so this BTS binder is not going to stay like this for very long because I'm going to be getting all of my bigger inclusions into a mini binder and then I'm thinking of actually getting transparent binders like I have for my multi binder and have one binder for just like normal photo card size things and then have another binder or for all of the mini photo card stuff so this is what I'm at currently thinking about my BTS collection but let's just get into it so I mostly have my Namjoon album photo cards Korean album photo cards organized by era so we just have oh are you late too then school love affair this is from the special edition reprint and then I was like, oh no, I do enjoy some of uh, their group photo cards and I thought it just looked nice in this row because it's kind of like white-ish, <laughs> clear colored. Then I have Dark and Wild, one of the Dark and Wild group photo cards. I think there's three, which is a little bit too much. So I'm just happy having one. And then I have my army membership card in the middle. Uh, <laughs> because I actually got the army membership when uh, they said you needed it for concert ticket pre-sales uh, but I am in Europe so the pre-sale just never happened and I just had this membership that cost a lot and it took them forever to send out the kit and it was just a whole thing but <laughs> in honor of uh, the hell it kind of put me through I just still have this card in the middle and it's nominative so I can't really do anything else with it. Then I've got Hey, hey Try Part 2, his photo card which 
These verticals are kind of size worthy, but they're really cute, so <laughs> it's fine. And then I do want to get the group PC as well because I really, really love it. And then I will have the dope photo card in here. Once I get it, I once had it on the way, but uh, it never arrived. And then I have the You Never Walk Alone page. You Never Walk Alone has some of my favorite photo cards, so I did want to collect a T7 for it and it's going slowly but it will happen <laughs> so it's still a work in progress but i really do love this set and it just makes me really happy to have it then we move on to love yourself her and love yourself tear so i actually have these two photographs on the way which completes my collection uh, for this page and I have a jeans PC in the middle because I pulled it and he is my Barris Wrecker so <laughs> I do like having him in my binder as well and uh, I just love this page a whole lot also I kind of decided to take out just the templates and just put in freebies and stuff like that that kind of match the era because I think it looks better than the templates and I re and I know which photo cards go where so <laughs> I don't really need to have the little sticky notes. And then we have Love Yourself Answer and Persona. And then I have Yungi's Persona PC in the middle because this is the first photo card I've pulled. The first BTS photo card I pulled. Well, actually, technically, it's German's Y PC. <laughs> but I did send that PC to my best friend Melanie, but I really pulled that like two minutes later. So <laughs> it still counts. Then we move on to uh, BTS World and Map of the Soul 7. So I really don't want to collect everything BTS World related, but I really do want this photo card because it's Namjoon in the rain and it looks real good. And then for the middle, for now I just have a blank filler, but I would like to either get a Jin or Jimin Map of the Soul 7 photo card, ideally version 2 or version 4, just because I think they look best and it will look aesthetically the best as well <laughs> on this page but I'm not too fussed about that yet it's very low priority and it will be once this is done <laughs> then we move on to B and the absolute photo card fest that this era was so this was B Deluxe with everyone's card and the group photo cards I really do love the Polaroid a lot and I'm very happy this happened then this is the B Essential page with Namjoon's Selka photo card. And here I will put the group photo card once I get it. But for now, I just have this duplicate Jin PC just to fill out the page and make it look nice. And then we have the absolute, I don't even have a word for what the lucky draws were <laughs> for B. But I do have all of Namjoon's lucky draws. And I have his pre-order benefit, his essential pre-order benefit, and the golden time and float event replicas, and I've got gins at the back. So these were the Japanese dollar holos, which I am not sure if you can see the holo a lot on camera right now, but they look really pretty. And then these were the other Dolex Grammy photo cards. Lucky draws, I mean, and these were the essential lucky draws. I am not collecting the room lucky draws because i feel like they don't really fit with those lucky draws anyway and i just don't love them that much because one is the far away concept which i'm not in love with and then the other one is horizontal and i don't love horizontal cards but yeah this is my prep page for butter and i hope that they don't do a b part two with the lucky draws <laughs> but then we move on to namjoon's japanese photo cards so i do have a bunch of work to do on the earlier eras but i do have his wake up photo card and his run photo card for now the i need you like special photo cards are a little bit harder to find but it is feasible i have seen them and then uh, the for you I need you standard PC should be easy to get. And then honestly, the no more dream PC for Namjoon. I've seen like good prices on Macro Japan, which is pretty surprising, but we love to see it. So <laughs> I will get to it at some point. And then for this page, I actually have the youth photo card on the way. So I actually kind of want to like get this out. <laughs> 
but I'm so happy with this page. Here I could put the With Us Prada Benefit for the journey, but I don't know if I'll ever be able to buy that because even expensive listings, I just don't see them on Mercury, so I don't know how I will get it. But this is a run handshake event photo card and I'm very very happy to have it and this is a fake love airplane pie 2 and this is the lights and yeah for the journey they started doing a few photo cards and we're like oh okay and then <laughs> BTS the best is happening I actually have all of these on the way and I still need to buy the with us product benefit but it seems to be attainable at the moment so I am excited to get that and then we move on to album bigger kind of inclusions for the cards so we've got school of affair i still need to buy nam june's arms down for the card then for young forever <laughs> so i do have hr part one and young forever for nam june and then for young forever i really do love these photo cards so very much so i really do want to get jimin's and the group and then maybe once i finish you never walk alone then maybe uh young forever will be my next 07 set <laughs> Then for wings, I actually have this on the way and I have this on hand, but I just haven't sorted it in. But this is complete and I'm very happy because I really do love wings a lot and I do really love the Polaroids as well. Then we have the Persona postcards. I still need to get soaps postcards, but for now I have a good dent in terms of OT7 and then I just have the Map of the Soul seven group for postcard here as a filler and i think it looks really cute and it fits everything really well then we start to have some dvd photo cards i still want to get the 2017 season screenings photo card because i think it's really really cute but then i kind of moved this around a lot <laughs> and i have prepped for memories 2020 already because we know it's coming sometime this summer and i'm pretty sure they will have a dvd and a blu-ray so i've set up for that <laughs> but here we have 2017 2018 2019 dvd photo cards 2019 blu-ray photo cards and then a winter package for the card, which is so cute. I put this side up because I like it a lot. And, uh, you know, it's a little bit goblin inspired and I really love goblin. So <laughs> I was like, let me put the match side uh, first. And honestly, for the 2019 Blu-ray, this side is so cute as well. So it was really hard to pick which side to put first. So I just put the what was considered the front, right? And then I actually put the DVD pieces together so it will let make a nice row in the middle and not necessarily do it by chronological order, right? So then we have some tour photo cards. This is Love Yourself Soul, this is Love Yourself New York, and I still need the Love Yourself Europe DVD. I also need the Blu-ray photo cards, but <laughs> those are not a priority. I would rather get the Memories Blu-rays first before the Love Yourself Blu-ray PCs, but yeah, this is where we're at. Uh, this is for Fan Meet photo card. And then we've got the 5th Master photo card and the 5th Fan Meet photo card. I really love those two so much. This one too, but these two are like so cute. I love them so, 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 so much. And I'm happy that they kind of match as well. And then here I have all of this on the way, but this is the one concept booked photo cards. They're not necessarily like tall photo cards, but I thought that they would fit nicely in there because it's still like the one concert. So... <laughs> I decided to put them here and once I have the Euro PC the bags will look so nice and I'm very obsessed with uh, the fifth master bag as well. This is kind of a catch-all page for now. Uh, we've got some Wings Tour mini photo cards, well even though they are photo card sized but I just put them here because for now they're the only two I have and then we have the one ticket cards and then we've just got the Chilson collab and the MTPR collab uh, which I really like this photo card a lot and then uh, we move on to mini photo cards which uh, this I think will be in a binder by itself uh, very soon but here are kind of just 
random mini photo card inclusions things. Here I will have the Hype photo cards, Hype Insight photo cards. And then we've got some more uh, <laughs> random tour photo cards. But we've got Love Yourself, Love Yourself Japan, Speak Yourself Japan. And I really do need to finish working on a tour mini photo cards before moving on to masters and fan meets. But... <laughs> There's just a lot. There is a lot. Then we have the Magic Shop 5th Master, well, 5th Fan Meet, because the 5th Master ones are very expensive to get, even though they look so cute and I really want them. But for now, we have the Fan Meet. And then we've got Speak Yourself, the final mini photo cards. And then these are the Map of the Soul tour photo cards, which uh, sadly never happened. Uh, and then we've got some Bang Bang Con ticket cards with the gold card, which is very, very cute. And then the Bang Bang Con mini photo cards, which uh, it kind of sense that they are so sort of similar <laughs> than the Map of the Soul tour ones, but we move. Then we've got uh, Map of the Soul 1 mini photo cards, which are not my favorites. Like the bags are just a little bit too dark in my opinion. But uh, the Suwuzu mini photo cards, I have them on the way and those are some of my favorite sets. And then we've got the one concept book. Uh, PCs that came in, like clear PCs. And you've got the OT7 set. This is the clue version. And then this is the route version. And then we are nearing the end of the binder. And these are just like random bigger inclusions. So we've got uh, Namjoon Seasons Greetings, Lenticular, as well as his winter package, like just live photo, which is so cute and I love it a lot. And then uh, these are facing this way because they're actually gin inclusions. We've got the New Year's Eve postcard and then uh, Break the Silence and uh, the Blu-ray photo for uh, memories. And then we've got some tour postcards, which I don't really collect, but uh, those were sent to me by my friend. And I kept them and they look very, very, very cute, but I never intend on completing those sets. Uh, uh, more <laughs> concept book inclusions. Honestly, I should move that to be with the mini photo cards, but I mean, bigger inclusions are going to yield out anyway. And then we've got uh, Namjoon and Jin's Serendipity Exhibition postcards. Those are the Korean version, I believe. I still need to get the Japanese versions. And then we've got a VD Cosmetic collaboration photo cards, as well as Jin's in the soup postcard and his clear card. But yeah, that is it for my BTS binder as well. I hope you enjoyed these flip throughs and I will see you soon in another video. Bye.